A deadly car crash that happened on Sunday morning in Charlotte took the lives of three people, including twin 27 year old brothers from Salisbury. As word spread this week that James and John Woodson were killed, it's brought shock and sadness to the community. WBTV's David Wisna joining us live in downtown Salisbury this evening, where the young men, David, they were very well known. How are they being remembered? Well, Didi, they're being remembered here as performers, actors, dancers, singers, even skaters. But there's also another part of this. They're also being remembered for their generous character. Here they are leading out the march in a production in Salisbury from a few years ago. The talent of brothers James and John Woodson was undeniable. They were the most talented kids. I mean, it's, that's the, the saddest thing about the whole thing is how much talent they had. Singers, dancers, actors, they started out in kid shows with us. The brothers performed in many shows at Salisbury's acclaimed Norval and Moroni theaters. Cam Hall is the box office manager. John and James were two of the most talented and kind young men that I guess I've ever met. They would do anything in the world for you and we were thrilled to be able to have them with us. Their lives ended tragically this past Sunday morning. According to the Highway Patrol, a man driving under the influence was going the wrong way on I-485 near University City Boulevard in Charlotte when he struck the twins car head on. The brothers were killed at the scene. So was a passenger in the other car. 33 year old Richard Brent Dunn, the only survivor of the crash, has been charged. Reed Leonard directed the boys in several shows. One of the things about it, an accident like this is, you know, how shocking it is, and everybody's stunned in the whole area. But, you know, how do you deal with everything? How you know, all the people who have memories, they're all calling. They're all Facebook is loaded yeah, with stuff, is. you know, from pictures from the show. Yes. You know. They were so young so talented with a great future ahead of them friends say it's just hard to believe it was all cut short so suddenly we're all heartbroken i i cried i had to tell people about it and it's it's just broken my heart and we just got some information within the last 15 minutes about a fundraising effort that has been undertaken by the Piedmont players who perform here at the Moroni Theater. They're going to be collecting funds to help pay for the two funerals that will be coming up. I'm going to work on getting that information on our website for anyone who may be interested. But in the meantime, you can go to the Piedmont players website and find some information there. Live in Salisbury, David Wisnett, WBTV on your side.